Hello everybody, my name is Ibrahim Al Damari, and today I'm gonna show you how to do convert, uh, how to convert from NRRD image to uh, DICOM image, or from DICOM image to NRRD image using 3D slicer. It's very simple. Simply, if we have an RRD image, let's say you have this one. You load it to slicer, then in slicer there is already a module that do that create a DICOM series from uh, volume. So what you need to do is you can change all these parameter, patient parameter or different uh, study parameters. Then select the volume. For example, I select this MRI image. Then you select where you're gonna save it. Let's say I'll put it in documents. I'll call it MRI DICOM, for example. Then choose. You can keep the default parameter or you can change them as you like. After you finish, you click apply. And in a few seconds, you will create the DICOM uh, folder. So if you go to the document, my documents, you can see here. MRI DICOM, the one we just created. So, how we do the opposite? It's very simple also. I'll just close the scene. And what I'm gonna do is convert from DICOM to an RRD. So, all what we need to do is click on this DICOM module. Then we import the DICOM image. Let's say we import from document, let's say this is a DICOM folder, I import it. And here we get some statistics, for example, we have in this folder one patient, one study and one 3D volume, and 121 2D slices. Then I click in the 3D volume. Here I can see some metadata if I am interested or I can just load it to a slicer directory. After loading to a slicer, I can just click save and decide where I'm gonna save it. I give it a name. It's sometimes very important to have a name without spaces or special characters. So I'll call it, for example, CBCT Cochlea. Then I click save. Here it's already in RRD format. I can change it to a different format. There are a lot of other formats we can save use. And if I go now to my documents, I can see that the RRD that I just created is already there. That's it for today. Thank you for watching.